My name is Mustafa Oba. There was no reason for him to treat me this I'm way, but he treated me like his own daughter. He made sure I'm, I'm that we were protected, well fed. Matter of fact, uh, for someone who says uh, we were prisoners, if we were not allowed to go somewhere, it's because it was dangerous. At the time I was there, uh, the Boko Haram were uh, kidnapping women. So I understood if I was not allowed to go somewhere, it was because it was dangerous. And we were given explanation. We were never there uh, by force. If we wanted to leave, we could leave. Good day, everyone, wherever you're watching from. Anyways, there is a new video that just surfaced on the internet, okay? This video is all about late prophet T.B. Joshua. So this video is the confirmation of what Rachel said. Rachel is that woman that came out to defend late prophet T.B. Joshua, okay? She said that she was actually with those women that came out to accuse late prophet T.B. Joshua for so many years. What those women said was not actually truth, okay? She said that late prophet T.B. Joshua did not imprison any one of them, okay? But sometimes they do not allow them to go out just for security reasons, okay? Because in that period, Boko Haram was terrorizing Nigeria, kidnapping women, kidnapping girls, and all, and all that, okay? But when she said all these things, she received a lot of attacks on the internet. A lot of people were saying that, how can she say that? How can she say that? Is Lagos part of northern part of Nigeria? Lagos, Boko Haram, she's lying, you know? She received a lot of insult on the internet, okay? So, this video is just the confirmation of what she said. If she was actually saying the truth or she was actually lying. So, please try to watch this video to the end, okay? And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please try to subscribe so that you will not miss out whenever we drop a new video because we are still waiting for the end. We are still waiting on how this whole issue is going to end. We are still waiting for BBC News to respond. We are still waiting for so many things, okay? So please subscribe so that you will not miss out whenever we drop a new video, okay? God bless you. Take a look. My name is Mustafa Omar. I'm from Adama State, Yola. And I'm a Mon Boko Haram member. So from that place, many, many souls who kill from Adama to Medjugorje side, Muntika, from Muntika to town of Gata. Okay. What brought you here? This is my first time to come to Lagos. And you came to where? And we come to this uh, Sunago church. We drop at this uh, junction here. The junction opposite the church here? Opposite the church there. Yeah. Okay. When you stop there, what for? So we stop there. The moral we use, we come to that church. We come to this uh, junction here. Opposite the junction there, one house I used to sell something. What is he selling? He sell all the sweet soap, secret, men, all this provisions. Okay, when you met the man, what has? So when we met the man, so we, we, we are five in number. So I hold the bag, the bag will hold, and the instruments will come with it. I meet the malam. I say, malam, please help me just keep this bag. You met the man, and you asked him to keep the bag. The bag and with him. The, the bag contain what? It contains some instruments inside, sir. What is the instrument? The instrument, all those instruments say to destroy, to kill, it's a bomb. Bomb, oh, okay. I give him the bag, say, I, I let keep this bag for me, he say, no. He don't keep anything here for okay. anybody. Okay. okay. So he don't, he refuse to collect the bag. Okay. So we decide to carry the bag and go with it. I say, let's sit down here and eat. Okay. So after we eat, that is where we think to do, uh, prepare our mission here now. So we sit down there eating food, then bring food for us, we are eating. So they are eating. So the woman have television in her show. We are watching the television. What was in the station? So we just that is Emmanuel television. I saw you particularly. You are preaching to people that time. Okay. So as you are preaching to people now, we are just sitting down eating. By the time you pray and you lay your hand something like this to your hand, it just be like you are doing with us. You just let your hand to to our face. Okay. Why the bag? that contain the bomb and your group were there eating. So you saw Emmanuel TV. As you saw that Emmanuel TV, I prayed, discussed, telling, preaching to people. As you just, as you are just praying, you didn't lay your hand. At once, we are just, in that time we are just eating, as you are just praying, preaching to people. As you just, at once you just lay your hand like this. And that, that hand you lay, and you lay it for, for our face, direct. So that is where the, 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 all our plans, 
Everybody, just confusion, just come between us. Assume you people were not in there when the prayer was going on. What was the plan? Our plan is to take the souls at this junction here. And it's now got church here. That's where we we'll enter. That's so where I tell that bomb inside the bar. Okay, how will you people will do that? It just be like something like meter. So there's wire that we will draw and mix it, join it. And as the button will press, we can set it one hour, we can set it to explode at one minute. We can set it to explode at three minutes. So, so, so you, that, uh -huh. if, we come, if we set it at five minutes, if we drop it, before that five minutes, we will leave that place. You people will leave the place? We will leave the place. What will happen? All the souls around there, everybody will go. What is your problem? Why are you here? Why I'm here? Since that day, I want to I want to go back home. I don't fit to go back home again. Why? Anytime I lie down, I will be seeing you. So the thing is disturbing me too much. It's disturbing me. So what, yeah, is, what is disturbing you? You are disturbing me now. I don't know what I did to you now. Where is your colleague, the other people? Everybody scatter now. Everybody scatter. Why are you alone? Why me alone? I don't know why I just stand alone. Because this thing is bothering me too much. This is my first time to come to Lagos. So other people will still be in Lagos? I don't know where we are now. They call them on the phone. Nobody agreed to pick his call again. Okay. Never. What are the bag the, with bomb? The, our master, the name is Balare Benasuru. He take it back. Okay, how do you come about these things? What gives you the courage to do this? How do you manage to have the heart to do what you are doing? Simple. And I use Arabic language to write it. After I write it, then wash it, then give me as a drink. That's the you I drink get. it. I drink it. That's the day I get the liver. After I drink it, I have the soul. I have the mind to kill the souls. Okay, why do you want to see me? Why can't you run away? Now, everybody run away. But you, why are you coming? Why here am I see? coming to this place? I want to go. I don't have the spirit to go again. That's why I don't want to sleep for night. I'll always be seeing you. You don't, you don't sleep in the night. I don't want to sleep. I see you be disturbing me, telling me I should don't go to you. I be praying for me. You lay your hand on me. That's why. Uh, he says he could not sleep and he could not rest and he has no peace. Why other people have run away? And, and I know anywhere they are too, they are under bondage. <laughs> they are under bondage, serious torture. Wish this man could not be a age. And he say he will not run away, he want to get free. I want to tell you that for the past two weeks now, I've been wearing this jeans. Can you see? This is two weeks now. I wore it last week. I wore it yesterday. The same jeans I'm wearing now. You should know that something is going on. I'm in a serious battle for the past two weeks. It's not possible for me to stand in your midst and begin to tell you what I have seen in the spirit about to happen. But I have seen it for the past three weeks. But I have also set a trap. All the look on the corner of the church. <clears throat> that anywhere the trap should cash. Not even we don't want them to enter here. Because entry here will create fear. But not just at the mayor discussion concerning the issue, the trap. But the past three is the brother here. I want him to be released. Because the heart wants to cut. He could not help himself. He doesn't know the direction to follow. So my mission is to separate him from the spirit that is controlling him. To do that. We are not to fight mere flesh and blood. We are to be armed for battle. Brother, you say the problem you are facing, you cannot sleep, you cannot close your eyes. I cannot sleep, I cannot close my eyes. Even now, I'm feeling headache because of I don't sleep. The thought of evil against the anointed man of God is a crime. And it's abomination to God if you are a true man of God. That thought, just sitting down somewhere, anywhere you are, you are thinking of, what can we do? How do we get him? How do we destroy him? How do we fool him? How do we disgrace him? It's God you are talking about. Touch not my anointed and do him no work. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
that bomb inside this place. Okay, stand up! Have you attempted any operation before and it failed? I never failed before. There is the operation will go in Air Force Base in Maduguri. Air Force Base in Maduguri? Yes, almost. You, you are one of them? Yes. Even we go to uh, Adamawa State in Munchika. Last two weeks past now. And you will never attempt anything and fail before? We never fail. How many did this one fail? Why this one fail us now as we come to this Snago Church now? Why we fail this? It's what the problem is when we go to eat. But we don't know what pushes us. We say let's enter inside the shop to go and eat. After we are, we sit down there eating because we are five in number. We face the television. When you lay your hand in the television, you just open your hands like this. You just on your our face. That's where the confusion just comes. Everybody just find a way. Okay, place your hand on your shoulders. So, the spirit that leading him to kill is gone. Il lui a dit que l'esprit qui de tuer est parti. Il va maintenant sourire pour la première fois. L'esprit que tenía de matar se ha ido en el nombre poderoso. How are you feeling now? How are you feeling? Oh my God. Huh? Thank you. Huh? Thank you. Speak louder. I say thank you. Oh, he's crying. Thank you. He's crying. <laughs> he's crying. He said, thank you. He feel different. Yes, if you give him something, he can't slap people now. Again. Talk less of killing people. So he has been delivered. He has a lot to say. Because so far, so the, a, a lot has gone. He's going to shit out everything that they have eaten. Because everything is neutralized now. But they say, one, this you used to wear. Yes. I'm used to wear it because that time the thing even tights me. But how do you know that I'm wearing something? Because. He said, What? He said, How did the man of God know that he used to wear something on his waist? <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. I'm very sorry, viewers all over the world. And uh, I know you want me to ask a lot of questions or whatever. He has said it all. The operation he has gone, he said this is the first time he is failing. So whatever you want to hear, that is not my nature. My nature, I love people. I do I'm not I can't fight mere blood and flesh. But the spirit being that caused this, my duty is to deliver him. Thank you. So if you are if you are thinking of repercussion, what will have happened if two hundred people just die? and the name of the ministry. 
if you are thinking about that, you should also think about Christ on the cross for you. After watching this video, I believe that you must have understood why this girl said what she said. Okay? So, if you were in late prophet T.B. Joshua's shoe, would you allow your visitors to go out in this kind of time? Drop your comment below and subscribe. Thank you.